Okay, so here we're going to um, show you how you can manage your menus. Um, menus is a new feature in WordPress from around about 3.0, and all of our clients are, are, are all up to date with, uh, with the uh, WordPress. Um, but basically, what, uh, what the menu management does is it, it controls your menu. Okay? And as you can see, my menu that's here is here. I keep it pretty simple. There's two, there's two uh, main menu items on this site. You'll see there's a contact menu up the top and then there's the main menu here. So there's a primary and a top menu. Okay, Some themes only have one menu, some have three, some have five. Most of them have one or two. Okay, So you can create as many menus as you like and you can use those menus in widgets as well. But we'll show you the widgets after this video. But the menu, basically, you'll get all the different pages you've crea that you've created, in some cases products, and all the categories. And again, you can manage what you see here um, on the screen, on the left-hand side, you can manage it from the screen options. Okay, so now what we'll do is we, I could quickly change that to there by dragging and dropping. I can also change the text on any menu item. Okay, you can also create custom links. Okay, so I can create a custom link to blah, and then I can add that to the menu. And all of a sudden, that extra menu item will be available. Now, I can do something additional to this: is I can go here, and I can um, I can go link target, and then select that, and then under here. I can open that link in a new window or a tab, especially if that link's going to an external website. Okay, so there's a few different options here. Okay, I'm going to remove this because I don't want this on my website. But you can drag and drop them. You can even have sub menu items and then sub sub menu items if you like to. But I think that's going a little bit too far. Okay, so that's basically how you control your menus. Now, depending on how you, your site's set up, um, you'll find the menus under Appearance Menus. There's certain things you don't want to muck around with, um, but you know it's uh, it's it's important that uh, that you that you at least understand how that works and ask your developer um, if you need to know further information. Okay, now we're going to have a look at what what the widget you get with this as well. So I'm going to leave this page. I'm going to go to the widget area. Okay, um, oops, sorry, widgets. I should say not widgets areas. Okay, so the widgets are basically the things that you'll see on the side. And sometimes you've got a footer widget as well. Okay, so you can see I've got footer widgets. Now, I can go and select custom menu from here and put this up the top. And I want the contact menu and I can go contact menu. And I can obviously spell it correctly too. Okay, I like to have everything nice and, nice and clean. So I can click add that. And then if I refresh the page, then you'll see the contact menu in the sidebar. Simple as that. That's how you control your menus and, uh, and, the, and the additional features. So you can create as many menus as you like, uh, but I only have the, the main ones controlling the top here. Uh, but you can also add these custom menus to the sidebar. So it's a great little uh, feature in WordPress 3 Plus, um, and you should take advantage of it.